Can you add clickable links to your YouTube video descriptions? Yes, you can. And stick with me. I'm going to show you why I think some people are getting confused by this. And one key thing that's really, really important, critical, in fact, that you have to do in order to make sure that your links are clickable. We're going to go over to the YouTube studio for one of my other channels, a newer channel. And I think it really makes sense to show this one as an example because it's being set up as kind of an affiliate marketing channel. So for every video, if somebody clicks on the link in the description and makes a purchase with the company that I'm uh, working with on the channel, then I can earn a commission on those purchases. So there has to be a clickable link. So we're going to go into the content tab on this page. And here you can go to any one of the videos on this list, but what you want to look for is this pencil icon and the word details pops up. So we'll just go to this very first video on the list and click on that pencil icon. And up comes all of the details of the video, including the description. Now you can see here that I've got a link here and a link here, two active links, but it doesn't look like they're clickable. When I hover over them, I just get that cursor icon, so uh, it's indicating that I can type something different in that space if I want to. So I think that's part of what confuses people, is it just doesn't look like it's clickable when you enter it into this space at first. But when I go over to the channel, here we are on the channel page, I'll just look for that video, here it is here. We'll open that and I'll pause it. And we'll open up the description here. And you can see here that the links are very clearly uh, hyperlinked, so to speak. So they are clickable. So I can click on this one, I can click on this one, and it will open up a new page. So in this case, the Indestructible Business Channel is aimed at entrepreneurs, and this company, Spearpoint Solutions, does things like training and strategic planning. So that's where the alignment is there. Back over on the YouTube Studio page, I just want to point out that these links have to be URLs. They have to have this HTTPS colon slash slash in front of the web address. So uh, I'll just show you what happens if you delete this. And so now I've got spearpointonline.com and don't have the HTTPS in front of it and I'll save that. And now if I go back over to the channel page, I'll just refresh this page. Now if I have a look at the description here again, you can see spearpointonline.com is not clickable now. So my other link is still clickable because I've still got that uh, complete URL listed there, but because I've changed that, it's no longer clickable. So that really is the key. You have to have that complete URL listed, and I'm going to go back and change that back. By the way, affiliate marketing is a way that small channels, even new channels, can start to make some money before they get big enough to earn ad revenue from YouTube. If you want me to make a video about that, let me know in the comments and I'll put that on my list. If you did find this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to the channel. I will see you in the next video.